hearing my music played by a marching band is super cool. I've been waiting for this moment all my life and didn't even realize that until I got it. Now, this man behind me, he wants to make homecoming at Howard University the very best that it could potentially be. And we know we still have work to do, but at the end of the day, I need you to understand something. We're gonna rock this crowd. While I'm being met with a lot of support and a lot of love from the department, and you know, there are some alum that pitch some concerns when it comes to protecting certain traditions. This type of performance kind of yields that opportunity to say, look, I got it. Hey, how you guys doing? Yeah. Are we gonna have a good time? Yeah. Are we gonna have a good time? Yeah. I need the horns, horns, where you at, horns, where you at? You are my lifeline and my lifeline, please. Make me look good. The community that we are creating is structured, of course, but still has that flexibility of feeling like family. You have some type of issue, you come to us. I could really describe it in one word as family. They're my first friends on campus. Like, these are the people that I come to and lean on in my times of need. It's really ridiculous um, how much they've been there for me and how much that I really give to them. We also want to build a sense of community where we're more competitive. And I think that spirit of competitiveness also kind of draws people together because now they have something to, to work for, something to build towards. Seeing how all these other bands are taking all these new creative ideas, it's like, well, what can we do to outshine them? And what can we do to make ourselves seem better in a way that they haven't already do? You know, like, think outside of the box that they've already thought outside of. They know that these are the elite groups that we are trying to excel and become like, and at some point surpass. You have bands coming from all over the country, then there's celebrities that'll be coming in and out of here. Our sororities and fraternities you know, they're gonna make it special as well. We set not only the foundation, but we th we're the icing on the cake too because we're the ambassadors of the university. All right, make sure we're picking up our feet while you're marking time, point the toes. I've been here before for homecoming. As an assistant, you know, we've had some great performances and we've had some not so great performances, but that fuels me to want to do better than what we've done in the past. We're always, you know, looking towards how can we improve so that we can put out a performance that's better than our last. Now this product with Just Blaze, it's gonna be hard to top this one. How are you? Welcome to the Mecca. Pleasure. <laughs> Happy to have you. Thank you. Okay. This 100th anniversary of Homecoming will set the standard for all of the artists to follow you. Oof. This moment is about a new platform, a new vision, a new way for us to engage our students, our alumni, everyone who is about community and the Howard University community. That is your charge. I just want you to know. Yes, ma'am. We're going to break the internet with this performance. Let's do it. Let's do it. We're also going to have the stadium rocking. Get ready for Just Blaze. Get ready for the showtime. Let's get it. Let's do it. Come on, y'all.